Before installing the tambour door, turn the cabinet upside down if possible. With a measuring tape, mark the location for the wooden dowels on each side of the cabinet. Drill the holes and insert the dowels. Align and center the door cover profile with the front of the cabinet. Fasten with screws. Compress the C3 system and slide into the cabinet. Slide the brackets over the dowels. Ensure that the system is level. Secure the necessary clearance between carpet and cabinet ceiling. Fasten with screws. Turn the cabinet right side up. Connect the frame track base to the cabinet and fasten with screws. Position the top end caps and fasten with screws. Snap the track cover into the track base. Apply the required pretension to the C3 system by turning the carpet clockwise. Refer to the installation instructions for the correct number of spins for various cabinet heights. Feed the tambour carpet over the guide roller and down the tracks. Pull the tambour slowly down to test the tension. If tension is not as desired, repeat the previous step. Pull the tambour carpet until it has cleared the ends of the track. Slide on the handle. Close the glider tabs and carefully guide the door back into the tracks. Install the stopper profiles on the back of the handle. Complete installation by connecting the bottom end caps. If necessary, remove any protective film. Your C3 system tambour door is ready for use. Thank you for watching this video. For further information, visit www.rayhal.com. The information contained herein is believed to be reliable, but no representations, guarantees, or warranties of any kind are made as to its accuracy, suitability for particular applications, or the results to be obtained therefrom. Before using, the user will determine suitability of the information for the user's intended use and shall assume all risk and liability in connection therewith.